So, hello everybody, ConvertMos 11.1 is out and it brings quite some bug fixes and some smaller feature additions. Let me walk you through it. So a minor change is here. Someone requested that we have more folders to search upwards. If you have a more complex folder structure here for the EXS24, so you can go now up to six levels, but be careful with that. It will search your whole hard disk if you choose a too high number. Next thing is all the reading of the WAV files, also AIF files was done in the beginning, which could cause a huge amount of memory usage, which also made the software hang on some computers, which didn't have enough memory. So this is now optimized that the WAV files or AIF files are only loaded when necessary. So quite at the end, normally when they are written. So it has now a much, much lower memory profile. And this also implies that it runs a bit faster. Talking about WAV files, in the previous version, we had here a source AIFF and WAV, and I aggregated now everything into one option, sample files, because they had the same settings anyway for the detection patterns and everything. And I threw in now all the formats I can handle now. So you can now create multi-samples from pure WAV files in the formats of WAV. AIFF, also flag the compressed native instruments format and AUG as well. And as I said, the settings are all identical and then you can put them into the destination format of your liking. There's also some fixes here in there because there was an issue that, for example, if you have flat notes, that the wrong flat note was identified, for example, B2 instead of E flat 2 uh, was such a thing. And so you could have uh, incorrect mapping. So maybe if you have already done some conversions which contains such notes or flat notes in the name, you should recreate them again with the current version. So that's it already. So until next time, make some funky music.